and the the Europe soccer and the US soccer. That's a the good European question. And that's US actually soccer. good that you talk about why we don't have player at the best in Europe coming in, in but instead they won't they stay in the U in the Europe to do their best instead of coming in America and, and do that here. It's also a money issue if you think about it, right? If you talk about difference in between US soccer and uh, European soccer, there's a lot of things that has to be, you know, we have to think about a lot of stuff. Mostly, I would say the structure point, because think about it, right? In Europe, those clubs, they have million dollars, billion dollars budget. Think about Manchester City. Think about Chelsea, Abramovich, the yeah, owner of right. Chelsea, which he owned. He, he Even owned New, Newcastle company, now. Newcastle <laughs> right now. We're talking about what? 80, um, 800 million uh, budget? Right. One billion budget for PSG, how much? Like, like PSG, it wasn't because of the fair it's play. It's just insane. Like, it wasn't f- like, you know what I'm saying? Those president and the strict in Europe is they different. They, they're really rich compared to here in America where the president, they share the revenue is sharing between the president, the owner, which, 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 which make it a little bit more difficult for the, for them to inject money. So, teams don't have enough money, enough finances in order to finance the, 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 the soccer program and the academy and lunch. So, it's kind of like restrict. But when you go in Europe, it's like the soccer. I don't know what you think about it, but I personally think that the structure and come to the money part, it's way advanced in Europe than here. What no, do you think about definitely it? Definitely, it is. Definitely. Yeah. Like, and in, like, in Europe, we have more people that watch games. Yep, that's true too. More people watch. That's like, true I, don't, I don't know if you in this, I don't know if you realize this, bro. Yep. But like, I was watching like with the Super Bowl final. Like, it was, I think it was Kansas City against uh, uh, Tampa. Talk about last year? Last year, yeah. It was, I, uh, two years ago, I don't even remember. I don't really keep keep track of it. But it was like 14 million people. And it was everywhere. They have 14.1 million people watching the football. <laughs> yeah. Bro, a soccer final. In the World Champions Cup, League the final, World we Cup have like at least 41 million people watch yeah, that. I think the World Cup is the biggest. Oh, we got like World Cup, they have like billion, billion, World Cup, they have like billion, 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 billion people watching people watch it. it. Yeah, the World Cup so final. What I'm saying? So they make way more money way more than money, that. Man. So I think that's like, part of the exposure too and I've like American too like I was saying like you're talking about like the culture whatever the culture uh, the, yeah the culture the, the, the structure the structure you know the structure the, the main problem is soccer in US yeah right is not a major sport that's true that's true you know what I'm saying that's true like so- it's crazy to us when we move here like if I, if I go to my high school baseball game I would have more people sitting there for four hours watching this game Eating chips, like they have no. Don't get it wrong. No, we're not saying that best. No, no, no. We're not saying best by. We're not. That's not what we're saying. But just to make you guys understand, you know what I'm saying? Soccer, soccer is not a major sport here. I'm pretty sure track here is more. Is maybe my like in amateur level. It's as most as popular, or maybe more than soccer. Definitely, I think soccer has come like FIFA. That's what I'm saying, bro. In Europe, in Asia, South America, Africa. Soccer is the main sport. It's more than soccer, man. Soccer is it's, it's more a, than it's soccer. A religion, it's, it's a religion. It's like a religion, like we said. It's a religion. Yeah, it's you know a what religion. I'm so like, it's just, it's just. Like at, at the same time, if if you think about it, that's why it's important to understand the the, the culture, the background. Because if you think about it, uh, America, it's I, I would say everything is money, money, money related. And when you think about soccer. You, soccer, you just need a ball and clips. And bro, soccer, it's, it's, and it's, a, it's a it's a sport of poor people. Very, Let's be honest. V- v- very good thing you bring that you bring that up because is a sport if, if you think poor. about it, it's a f- if the you poor. think about it, guys, yeah. go go back and see all the legends. Yeah. names, right? Yeah, they are all poor. They all came from poor background. Soccer maybe maybe my fan one on two. That's yeah. okay. Mm-hmm. Like Kaka Ricardo, you know, in Brazil, his family had his family was a poor. Yeah, you know, but most of those guys. Mm-hmm. Pele, Ronaldinho, the, Ronaldo, you talk about Pele, they will play Ronaldo. with no shoes Ma- on the Mares, bro. You talk about those are the old ones in the no, no, Mares was example. in a rich family. Cristiano Ronaldo Cristiano was, was in a rich family. You know what I'm saying? Like, okay, we can say Messi. Messi's family wasn't rich. His family was just modest family that parent nine to five, go to work and come back. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Come. But it's not a rich family sport. It's, so it's the sport of poor. We so got to be, we got to agree sport. on so that like, first. So all the, sp- all the country that, that poor, Soccer is the only thing they leave. That's the only thing that give yeah, that make people um, wake up, wake up every morning. Yeah, keep, yep. Like it's actually, really important. they don't have a college to go. No yeah. scholarship. Soccer is the only thing. You see what I'm and saying? And we bring us, we which bring us actually to the second, the the, the culture point because I feel like it's cultural. Yeah, yeah. If Co- you talk culture about and structure, culture and structure from scr- from structure to culture because that's so important. Because you think about how soccer is a religion in Europe and here you come here, it's like, uh, uh most student. They have a choice to pick soccer. You know what I'm saying? When in Europe, it's not a choice thing. 
Uh, most no, people, I, I would say we still have a choice. We still have a choice. We still have a choice. Okay, okay. Let's hear. Good to okay, hear. Go bring ahead, that, right? Go ahead. Go ahead. When I, when I, when I, like, I first moved to France, right? Yeah. I had a choice to play soccer yeah. or rugby. Yeah. Two sports. Yeah. I moved to US. My first day, I was in school. Yeah. My, my, my counselor taught me, football, baseball. So I, I was overwhelmed. At thirty, uh, about um, eighteen years old. Yeah, I, I was seventeen. You were 17. I was, yeah, I, you were I was over, I was overwhelmed. You like, know what I'm saying? Okay. I'm like, what's going on? I was actually eighteen. <laughs> I'm like, what's going on? Yeah. But you know, you in France, they give him two options. Yep. Do you wanna get? Do you wanna get? Uh, what is him? Body with people in the rugby. I don't think you wanna get body with somebody that's three hundred <laughs> pound right now. No. Yeah. Gotta go with soccer. So you know what I'm saying? And then most of the rugby rugby guys, sometimes. They were soccer player before, yeah. So in Europe, it's hard to see somebody that can pass the ball. You know, it's you know kind of hard. Everybody, hard. soccer is everybody. Even the overweight, the, like anybody, Bro, everybody, because, athletic, like, athletic like, or not. You talk, you talking about people, somebody people. that's overrated. When you go to the street foot, those are the best guys. Those got the best guys. Those got the best guys. You want those guys on team? You want those guys <laughs> in your team? This guy, man. But those, those are really guys. I'm are telling guys. you, those if you go, guys, if you go to the street foot right now. You pay him five v five. You say I don't want this in my team. They will okay. embarrass they you. Will embarrass they will you. embarrass they you, embarrass man. You. They're not. They're not fit. They might not run for ninety minutes. Yeah. But my friend, if you give him the ball, they will embarrass they'll you. Be, so be careful hey, on those guys. Different, man. In my team, I only yeah. want those guys. Yeah. No cap and that, one fit guy. But definitely, like, you know, like you say, it's definitely part of the and, culture. And, and, and if and you think about it, wise. like, uh, the, also somebody that is thirteen, you know, in Europe at thirteen, bro, scout. They be coming at your game at what? Ten years old, bro. At like thirteen is too what? late, bro. Thirteen, they already know who bro, they want. Ten years old, bro. Like they come at your game, like scouts. I'm talking about Manchester United. I'm the Manchester United coach. I'm, I'm, I'm here to see your son. I'm like, what? I'm like, like, and, 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 and guess like, what? And guess what? And, and those scouts, thirteen yeah. years old, they would give. Let's say your family is poor, right? Yeah. I come to your house and I tell your dad, I want your, I want your kid to go in my academy. We will take care of you. Yeah. We'll make him and everything. But if your dad is like, no, I don't know if my kids want to leave. Okay, we we'll give you fifty, fifty k check. Just you know, like to leave with a twenty five, thirty k. Just got Man, you need to sign. Your just parent, your sign. parent will push you there. You they will kick you out of the house to go. No <laughs> you, you just need to sign. You know, you gotta sign. And guess what? At thirteen, if you're too young, your parent go sign for you because they, that. That's what I'm saying. Yeah. Most of those guy parents, like even what is it? Hakimi was saying he had to be pro because his mom sacrificed a lot of things for those parents. Those family never seen that kind of money. You see what I'm saying? Never seen. But I just feel like. The, it's like you say it's mainly the culture Men, you know what I'm saying mainly. but one big point that I have I have to bring it's at a young age having all these options like we said yeah. all the, like like I used to coach soccer here you yep. see you see the kids man kids go like yeah I, I just came from softball practice uh, I just came from baseball practice I'm like, I thought you play football. Yeah, coach. I play football. I play baseball. I play soccer. And in my hockey, <laughs> soccer, <laughs> after soccer practice, my hockey practice is coming. <laughs> that was in the summer. I look at the kid like this. He doesn't even have the time to go play Fortnite with his own friend. And he was 11. I look at him. Say, man, you hurting this kid. I mean, I no, don't. Larry, you hurting the kid. I don't always think it's, a, it's, a, it's hurting not like this kid. hurting him. But it's just like. Guess what? You hurting the kid? Do you really want him to go pro? It's not about hurting. No, He's bro. probably enjoying it, bro. enjoying it. But the, the, at the end of the day, if you want to be pro, you gotta focus on something. This is the thing, right? You heard, you still, you still hurting this kid. <laughs> you think so? Yes, because like if you didn't watch the video, go watch our video that we post and we have a podcast. You know, make sure you go subscribe and go watch that video. We said it. If if you playing soccer, yep. and I'm playing four sport, if. I, like because the goal is if I have a kid, I don't want him to be to be like average at ten sport. I want him to be good at one sport. That's the that's the goal. That's the goal. You see what that's I'm the saying? goal. The goal is to be good at one sport. I want him to be good at one sport. So if I'm competing with Larry that playing three sport at the same time, right? And then Le- Larry playing Larry playing three sport. I'm only focused on one. Yeah. You can co- you can be better than me one year. But bro, in three years, you cannot be my level if I practice with that every time. And, and then, you know and, what I'm saying? And, and then guess what? It's hard for the team to, if it's hard for the kid to, to pick because his average are all of them. So yeah. he's like, I don't know what I want to pick. Yep. You see what I'm saying? Yep. And look this. Most of the kids, they play soccer, they play hockey, they play baseball. And then let's say like their freshman year, they choose hockey. But guess what? What they did? They waste four years. That's four years. That was the time for them to get fundamentals. Yep. Same thing in soccer. They play multiple sports 
And then they realize they got caught in basketball, they got caught in football, they got caught in baseball. Soccer doesn't have enough people. They exactly. will take you. Take you. You, got, you still have to pay to get to play there. And that's one of the big difference between US and Europe. US are young age. Right now to play Minnesota Academy, even though you're a good player, you still have to pay them to play in that team. It's Do we in the academy? Do we? What? Do we? Do we have to pay to, to play? Actually? I think so. You have to pay that's to play crazy, in the academy. Man. That's crazy. I think you have to pay. I think you have to pay That's because crazy. in Europe, they I make, heard the academy make you pay too. I heard yeah, they make like you pay some money in Europe. Like the, the academy, academy will pay you, pay you to be <laughs> the in their team. Pay you, Look yeah. the difference there. It cannot be different. Like think about that for a second. In US, you gotta pay even even not even academy. Let's academy say let's say teams, team. yeah, club teams, club team, yeah. but a good club team that compete with academies, right? Because that's where the academy go go take the player. You have to pay there to to uh, to play. And it, you have to pay. You don't have to pay like one hundred dollars, three hundred dollars, oh. or even even one one thousand yeah. dollars a year, bro. You have to pay like six, four, like four thousand. And and then that's true. Yeah. Quickly, you brought that point. No, no, I'm thinking because I was wondering if you really have to play. Zlatan Ibrahimovic was complaining about it when he came to the. He was yes. playing the MLS. He was saying that the thing with soccer in, in in America, sport in America, I have to. I have five kids. I have to pay each six six thousand. How many thousand for each of them? That's no sport. That's, that's not sport. He was it's not sport that's not because he was those teams make money. They make money. They make so money. Like, I think. I think you cannot write some academy. You see, you see what I'm saying? So like, yeah. it make it make it hard. So that's why like. Hard. So that's why like, even if if you if you're in US right now, you wanna stay here to play. Yeah. And you still got to pay six thousand to play there. And I'm European team. I tell I say Larry, I will want you in my team, and I pay you seven hundred dollars every month to play every my team. Month. And when you come with me, you don't gotta worry about rent, what you eat, how you go to school, how you dress. I got everything. Yep. You're gonna do it. And then, and at, the, at that academy, they don't even gotta worry about dress. All they have, they wear the, the, club, like the, the clubs, clubs, yeah, the, the club clubs stuff. Yeah. So they don't even gotta worry about dress. Yeah. That's All actually good that you, you see what that I'm saying. Because that's, I feel like that's a, it will go to the, like the criteria of uh, player development, of course. which was one of my points. So it's actually good that you, you, you brought and that and up. And then here, you're talking about player development, right? Yeah. It's better, I think, in, in Europe. In Europe, parents understand at the young age, yep. if you want your kids to be good, the environment, the like the having fun. We say this in all, most of our video. I say this in most of the video. You can't, you can't ask a kid to go and have fun in sport and be competitive and be good at it. Yep. Parents understood that. I remember I was a young age. I was in the car driving with my, with my, with my, like with my parents. They would literally yell at me because I didn't perform well. That's bro. You know, you be like there too. At, at that time, at that time, Bro. at that time, let, let's not be, let's not be like, let's, you know, what I'm saying, let's yeah. be focused on it. Let's be honest yeah. to it. It might be hard on the kid, yeah, right. But you preparing him to tell him life is not that sweet. Yeah. Life is not that sweet. Yeah. And I, I had all my friends that parents was tough on them to go right now in friends. They yeah. all pro. I, and then, and then, and then, and most of them they pro. Even though they didn't sign the pro contract, bro, they living life out of soccer. They have a girlfriend, kid. I had a soccer. Soccer is paying for the sh- soccer is paying for the shit for the thing for the apartment and everything. You know what I'm saying? But in US, no, he's having fun. Go and your friend have fun. Don't go too hard. Like, bro, if you want your kid to compete in sport, just like football, do how they take it, it serious it's as the at the young age. At the young like, age, at the young because age. you know, if you wanna be, if you wanna play in Alabama, you cannot play you football, cannot to, play have football fun. to have fun. You gotta win. If, if like in in France, if you wanna have fun, even in Africa, if you wanna have fun. We go five v five on Sunday. That's why we have fun. That's our fun. Larry, if he if he's a striker, he can play goalie. He can play defender to have fun. I can dribble. I'm a defender. I can dribble. We mm-hmm. can do whatever we want. But once we go to the club, that's not for fun yeah. no more. Because that's not fun no more, my God. That's not fun no more. No. Because their parent, like parent, actually, in France, I've seen this my own eyes, my own team. Yeah. We're playing a game. Yeah. We're losing. Half time, parent grabbing the chair, the chairs, they're leaving. and they're leaving. They're it's leaving. too cold. Like, I, don't, I don't watch this. You know I'm what not, they said? You know what they said? We go in the car. Once the game is on, call us. They don't watch it. In US, like in my like for example, if I if I go to some school, right? Even in my high school, they will play a football game. They will come to me. Us, we have football games, so you wanna come? I'm like, yeah, bro, I will come. Are you guys winning? Nah, bro, we can't win against ask him. Why are you asking me to come there? <laughs> I gotta first of all, I gotta pay five dollars to get there. I don't I don't I don't wanna pay. It's five dollars, but I, I still don't wanna pay. <laughs> and I gotta leave in the court. Hey, that was funny. I'm not used to the court. Yeah. I still gotta go watch you guys. And you just you, you, you tell me that you tell me that you're losing, you're the, losing game. the game. Why would I go watch why you? Why would I go watch you? Larry, just like why would I go watch you? Make that <laughs> thing make, make sense. Make that thing make sense, bro. You see what I'm saying? Like, but they're having fun. No, we're having fun. Good vibe. We yeah. gotta support. Like, okay, bro, I would go for the girls i would go for the boys you know like i would go for them yes not for the game not for the game even the people that go there they don't even care about the game some because people go there just to chill and you know have fun with because the football game be fun 
Yeah. Bro, look at it. Like, he, he can find some college school, some college team that, like, they, we know they're going to lose. <laughs> but we still go because people people can do people in, can in college. Fun. They can have fun. They yeah. can do after that. They can go to the bar. They can go to party. Like, that's what I'm saying. So, the game itself is not even that competitive. It's not that competitive. So you see what I'm saying? This, this, and yeah, and this because, because, because that's how young age. That's how young age. We put them in their mind. Just having fun. So, they go to high school. They just have having fun. fun. Just having fun. It's co- it's it's a competition. Meeting their buddies. It's a competition. When you go to work, you're competing. If right now you give a work to Larry and I, and you say somebody is gonna like we're gonna judge this work, you uh, you technically prove us on competition. Yeah. I don't care what you say after that. We're in competition, even though we're laughing, we friend, but we know somebody gonna have to do better than someone. 